Well, the judgment reaches the sky. Go to the location mentioned in the lead in the document. Somewhere in this location, there's a bunch of villagers here. Yeah. Going to run, run, ignoring you. First time to put two in, but look at the things scattered around. Someone must have been here before. Ah, uh, ah, uh, messy footprints. Get me out. Oh, what a mess of footprints. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smash Crater. Once today, something was like, but whatever it was is now from cinematic page. Of canvas, the one part of it has been all canvas. We found a part of the Go ahead, I'll take your punch. Stay, can you hear me? Cyclone passed through here. I think she's in here. It's red. She's gone. She's just... Oh, with fury. One man of fury. Please come, come back here. Come back here. Rip all your levels of your life or trumpet your bones. Uh, which direction? Does she even know what she's saying? Catch me alive, catch me alive, will you? Oh, you'll catch me alive, alright? What's a glittery last drop of the blood? Hey, there, hey, there wouldn't be anyone left alive to do. Withdraw, withdraw, it's too late, we're dealing with a monster. Stop freaking flipping the thing! You gave me to Ari. That's everywhere. Oh, it's quite a little bit, and now it's you guys in what other. Those spies have you gotten for us. Me killed my stuff. Coco Yuri. Jack Metz no Tuck. 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 Done, man, done. What should we do now? Yeah, yeah, where are you? We're gonna have to fight her, aren't we? Wow, they pulverized the door. Yeah, look, is that your head over there? Let's go quickly. Uh, caution. Are you more caution? What's over here? Huff, huff. Huff. It's over. This kid. Is she injured? Ladder. Wait. Ladder. Ladder. Rafa, is there murder here? Uzad, Tefrif. Can I do his names? Yes. Huh? Well, oh, here, Dr. Squirtle. Sorry, I might have lost my head back then. I'm sorry for getting caught as well. It's not important, are you hurt? Is it serious? Come here, I have something to tell you to. Tell me, that you still remember my mother's name? If so, prove it with your sword. Hey, uh, what are you talking about? Tell me straight to my face that you aren't speaking about traitors, then prove it. I'm not a traitor, what happened to you? If you're not, if you're not a traitor, you'll prove, if you're not a traitor, you'll prove it with your sword. Tabaki no ikus. Hey, 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 what's the matter with you? Smokers, you the tool, you the head, you the ah, blast! Now then, let's talk. I won't, I won't hurt you, please, trust me. Whatever, I'm done with this. This was Azric, now it's you. Ah. Calm, calm down, we were all deceived. He's right. You see that the main trap asked you to hunt us down because we betrayed the tribe. But you know what? That's the exact same mission she gave us. We didn't believe you'd betray us, so we're trying to find you and figure things out. Uh, so I didn't betray the tribe, nor do I have any reason to do so. The main trap level has witnesses on her side. 
Griffin saw you deal with the Novenas and Messira, saw you moving around the camp. What? No way. She also told us that you. She also told us that you were spotted killing with the enemies of the tribe. Oh, why did they say you betrayed us? What's going on? Eh, uh, buy my wish with you. Anyway, calm down and let us explain. If it's Babel's designed to pit us against each other, will they defend us or the matriarch? Hmm. Think about it, Janet. Who do you trust more? Us or them? Quiet down, would you, Paimon? This whole thing doesn't make any sense. Ugh, you finally put down your weapon. The weapon's down. Let's not draw them again, shall we? You yeah, find one quite afraid. Don't be so optimistic yet, little ones. She could still use her blades. Nay! Nay, Rob. Nay, Rob. Rizzi. Rizzi. Why are you here? I can handle things alone in here. There's no need for you to pitch in. Uh-huh. I can tell you're doing pretty well, Jed. That's why Rizuki and I both needed to deal with the two of you. And there's also this little genie. Oh. The little genie. I'm quite fond of her. I'm quite fond of her. Let's spare her. What? Alright. <laughs> They plan to kill us both and just take time on. That's actually really funny. <laughs> wait, have, wait, wait. Have you, have you also betrayed the tenant? No. On the contrary, we're here to deal with traitors. I see. Were they? That's not important. They used to be good people. Niram, risky. It was a pleasure being your friend. Now oh, forgive me. Alright, let's do this. Hey, Falcon, that's it. So, so have you been injured? Oh, he's just watching from over there. <laughs> oh, what do you mean? I'm not bothering to read most of We shouldn't really shouldn't have taken this job. Okay, guess we could probably talk to us. She's silent in her head. <laughs> <coughs> Mitra and Babel send them. What do you think they will do? You should take a look at this. Transfer notification, preliminary test on experimental subject, internal withdrawal document. She can't read, right? So she set up the trap long ago and was just waiting for us to walk right into it. Wait, why didn't you show me this earlier? We would have, but you didn't give us a chance to speak before drawing your weapons. You wouldn't listen to reason either. Um, oh, I'm sorry. Thank goodness you're alright. Regardless, I have to get to the bottom of this. I need answers from her. <laughs> we still have time. You should rest. Yep, yep. There's no need to rush it. We can return any time. Yeah, while well, Babel has to wait for us. I'm on track. The initiative is on our side now. The initiative, huh? Hmm. Alright, Jet. Show us your wounds. We'll help you bandage up. My wounds? Where? That's right, they're everywhere. Seriously, though, I can keep going. Don't try to downplay it. 
and let's have a look. Besides, she took a look at me that other time while I was unconscious, so that is perfectly fine. Hmm, okay, I suppose that's fair. You help me undress, you help undress your head and dress her again. After carefully tending to Jet's room, you get some rest together with her by the campfire. Ooh. Jet sleeps peacefully by your side. Amidst odors of blood, sweat, and burning poplar branches, cannot fully mask the scent of spices she carries. Night snoring and raving nonsense intertwines in her dreams. She must truly be tired. Here, yeah, without speaking to one another, you both know what must happen once she awakens. Let's go! Let's find Babel and have her explain everything to us. You and your head arrive at the entrance to King, where Matriarch Babel happens to be waiting for her subordinates. Go and confront Babel. There she is, probably waiting for Nero and Rizki. Morning again! The assassins that came after us. We fought them already. It was roughly here? Uh -huh. yep. Fair enough, they're still alive like poisonous yet. Nice. Oh wow, we can get really close. And uh, empty head. What about the other guy? Empty head. You oh, and they're the two guys that we met right at the beginning. It's you, Jet. You're, you're back. Yes, I'm back. Alive. I'm sorry. It, it, does, it does my heart good to see you return safely. You must be in need of some rest. Come, let me see what I can do. I don't need to rest. I need answers. Why did you lure me into the northernest trap? Why did you send other members of the tribe to kill me? Why do you want me then? Calm down, Jared. Listen. Do you remember what I told you of how the eternal wishes the turn its home and how it will bestow a prosperous homeland upon us? It is exactly for this cause that you pledge lo your loyalty to me, no? Now that the door to the oasis is open to the tenant, you must keep it a secret from outsiders. You must ensure that the tenant are and will remain the most beloved children of the Queen of the All Oasis. Only thus can we guide the other wandering desert tribes to gather by the oasis. And when they do, just think about it. They will allow us to reunite the scattered peoples of the desert and their resources. Under the guidance of the Queen of All Oasis, we will rebuild a nation of oases, uh, oases in this desert with our own two hands. And once that is done, none of us shall ever have to bow to the city elk ever again. We will be able to build our own palaces, develop an academic system unique to us. We shall even challenge that god who not but a mere cage bird. Uh, she's not a cage bird anymore. We set her free like an entire version ago. Of all those things of that I told you, I will not listen to a single word. And I told you, it is not impossible. The queen of all oases is long gone. She's not in the oasis. There's no way we can resurrect her. Preposterous. Even as my most beloved daughter, how dare you spout such nonsense? Whether she is alive or dead, whether she can or cannot be resurrected, as long as the eternal oasis is under my control, all such things will be mine to decide. I shall be the sole prophetess of the slumbering goddess. The tenet's law shall be divine edict, and the prosperity of the tenet shall be the preordinance of the divine oracles. But before all of that comes true, Jet, it's not yet too late to repent. You are my most beloved daughter, and I wish to set you back on the right path. I... I don't understand. What do you mean? I made my point clear. 
The one and only Oracle demands absolute obedience. Humans who have been blinded by the truth of the Oasis are you and the outsider friend. And this outsider remains the master of the genie, though the genie herself has long gone silent. We can gain control over her as long as we get rid of her master. Of the two of us, it's I who respects her ancient wisdom and the power to rebuild the Oasis. It's more fitting, therefore, that we regain with a regained mastery over the genie. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? You dodged the bullet. Then you put you dodged the question last time, and that is understandable. But today you must make your choice: turn it, your home, or this outsider, this friend of yours. Wait, are you saying that you discussed how to get rid of me previously? Yes, but I I refused. I mean, how could I? It's so important to me. It still kind of hurts to know that you're planning to get rid of me. Although it does make me happy that it took that you had to have a discussion. Normally people just decide on their own and they always feel so badly. I'm sorry, my child, but sacrifice is necessary. I shall not let her normal blood be shed in vain. On that you can have absolute faith in me. As for you, Jet, you will become my successor. And one day you will be the tenant's new matriarch and Nabu Malikata's prophetess. Please, consider my offer. The future of our home lies in your hands, my daughter. Merely ask it of me, and I will give you time and one more chance. There's no need. I've already made up my mind. Eh, uh, I'm sure you don't want more time. The situation like super tense. Abel, Abel, I appreciate your help all throughout this time. Though I'm well aware of the fact that I'm the daughter of a traitor and an outsider. I couldn't be more grateful for your arrangements. The things that I've done for you, the voices of silence for you, the elders who've disappeared. Elder Bell, the one who liked crocodiles, surely you remember him. Treated you like his daughter, and he doted on me as well. That's why I could plunge a poison dagger into his chest. El Elder Guafa was such an eyesore to you, and you were dead to him too. And sadly, it was me in the end with a sumpter beast job on. Again, and again, and again, and again. You know, the first, that was the first time I've ever sh been scared to tears. I was so afraid of myself. Still remember how you wiped my tears away. Hold on, are you saying? How could that be? They're really bad at reading between the lines, but I like, did you not see the crumpled disc? Wait, why are you bringing this up? Why do you have to bring this up in front of them? Ah, uh, and there was also Elder Tia. She was young and beautiful, and she was the head of the hunting party. A more capable competitor than you. She thought I adored her, but I was loyal to you. I believed that you alone were my true family. And I believed that you could wipe my tears away once more and give me your own. So I made her disappear in the desert. And what is the point of this meaningless talk? You... You... You are the sole oracle of the goddess. And my mother. Why should there be any secrets between us? If you wish to hear more, I can spell every one of my deeds out to you and to all the ten. Everything I've done for you, my mother, and for this family. I've done enough. I'm fed up with it. I won't betray Dr. Squirty. You're mad. How dare you slander me, your matriarch. You've forgotten your mother's name. Silence. I bid you to be silent now before it is too late. My mother's name is Ophira. Ufaira Hindi. She was an honest person. Ah, so it was true then. The traitor's daughter could never be anything but a half grown mongrel, just like her father. Several and that outsider woman have already paid the price for the unforgivable thing they did. And now their daughter repeats their errors. I should have seen that coming.
We're firing him. We're firing him. That's her name. And that will be mine as well. Traitor. All of my teachings were for nothing. May the desert mark your treachery. Enough, my kin. You know what to do. She's angered and sad at me. Eh, hold on. Don't get some work up. You can just say that you see Jade as your daughter. Say it's not for that stuff. You're so interested. Paimon, shut up. We're fighting now. Uh, anyway, there's, there's gotta be a way to come to an understanding. Uh, uh, oh, I see. Paimon, hide yourself. Keep your eyes closed and don't dirty your white clothes. Release <laughs> the blood. Thanks, you gotta weave, don't chase it out. Come on, Pamela! Wait, Jed, anyway. She's still up here. At the. He doesn't follow. Yep. No. Time to solve this out. You're trying to stop me right now, aren't you? <laughs> Thought I was steady off this shit. Yeah. I have to look at them all. Babo, watch closely how I call your tribe apart. I hope you are wallowing self Ah, it's you. The Phineas dog I'll tell you apart. He's on the road. <laughs> Remember with your wounds and fear the jet will fire a hill. Remember this name. Wow, so she gave herself a lot of names. So. Catch up with Babo. Wow, she's just waiting here for us. <laughs> Come on, fight me. Are you not satisfied? You tried to hurt me and now you must pay the price. Same goes for your tribe. And my tribe, my people. And you! Oh. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Look what you look upon us, the tenant, ruined by a single traitor. My tribe, my kin, my eternal oasis. Say goodbye to them, but you still have time for some final words. Why, I once loved you so much, why did you betray me, and the tenant? Why? Because you're evil and I'm not. I see no reason why I must explain myself to you. Uh. Alright, Babel, let me tell you. It's because Dr. Squirtle is my best friend. Just best friend? For now. I wanted, I wanted to get rid of her, but I still refuse to be part of them. And you decided to get rid of me too. <coughs> no, you're more despicable than that. You wanted to pit us against each other. Only then did I realize you are no prophetess, nor do you deserve to be favored by the queen of all Oasis. You are just a despicable schemer. You're, you're the foolish one. An outsider. You did all this for an outsider. I... 
We're your real family. You destroyed everything. You destroyed the hopes of the tattered goats of all the tribes of wonder amidst the gilded, gilded sands. Stop bigging your, stop bigging your, stop bigging yourself up. I just pushed your tiny sand dune over, and that's all. Really, I'm the one with the questions here. What kind of mother would force a daughter to kill someone she cherish anyway? Answer me. Some family you are. Huh? You tried to take my life. The best take your idiotic dreams of being a prophetess. Well, someone might fill in just there. I'm sure they'll keep their hands cleaner than you did. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha. Father already sent tr scouts to inform all the tribes of your betrayal. Soon it'll be known that you're a traitor who tarnished her family's tribe. All across the vast desert, very sweet. No one will ever accept you again. Never again will you find a safe place to lay your head. And when did you do that? Haha, uh -huh. right before you came back. So you always wanted us dead then. But, but you said you wanted to give me a chance to repent. Is that also a lie? I thought you'd soften to make it easier to get rid of you. You disgust me, all of you. You and the group reach the entrance to the canyon, and Jihad has sorted out her feelings. It's all over, or is it? Why would you head out of this place? So sorry, I don't know what to say. <coughs> you didn't know you would turn out like this. And now... There's no place for me in the desert either. News will spread quickly among the along the trade paths. Soon all the thermites will know that I'm a treacherous person that can't be trusted. But I still have you to I can still trust you, can't I? Of course. If you have any help, just call. Send a message to the adventurers. You can always trust us, Jet. Yep, just call us. If you can't find us, send a message to an adventurer's guild. And they should be able to help me, yes. I, I know. It's just that I'm left with no one to return to again. I, I know. It's just that I'm left with no one to return to again. But, put another way, you're now free to call anywhere you wish home. Like me. Oh god, this is so cringy. Oh god, no. No, cancel that line. I'm not reacting to that with her voice. If, if it were me back then, I would I'd have thought you were mocking me. Uh, but you're right. You're right. Now, I'm, I'm, now I'm the head of my own house. I'm no longer a servant bound by the name Tanif. I'm now the master of the name Jacob. I've reclaimed my mother's name. I'm free. Perhaps Jet will also become the name of a new clan someday. Maybe? I don't know. Yes, my mother's name give me, gives me pride. And my father's name also holds many memories for me. As long as I remember them, even in this barren desert, would that not be ho the home that I was seeking all along? Now, home need not be a cause of anxiety for you. Thank you. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'd love... I'd love to go on more adventures with you. Haha, <laughs> never mind that. You must have had enough of me after all the dangerous situations I've been in. Well, I don't mind. After all, even without you, we either way get into dangerous situations. If you ever want to come adventuring with us, just give us a call. But... But... I, 
I can tell that you have your own journey. A travail of greater solitude and of a far greater objective. From which are beyond what I can bear or imagine. As for me, I've also set myself on a certain path. You've seen it already. It's not gonna be a peaceful one. I won't drag you down with me. Come on, Jet, you're not dragging us down or anything. Anyway, if you ever feel tired or want to take a breather, I believe that our paths will converge one day. At that time, I might even invent invite you to go on a crazy adventure with me again. Well, if you ever do, I'm absolutely gonna accept it. Oh, poof. I've done enough... Oof, I've done enough talking. It's time to leave. There's nothing left here but her. You hold your head before parting waves and further in the desert. She holds you tightly, almost as if, as if afraid that a blinding sandstorm would sweep you away. You notice that she seems to be holding back sobs. Then she pushes you away like and rubs her wet eyes before smiling broadly at you once more. May we meet under a lovely sun, she says. Jet turns away and leaves. You see Ben Ben, only now emerging out, emerging out of the ruined camp, hurry to catch up with Jet. Or she shall surely be returned. I hope we get to meet Jet again someday. Well, that was all for this recording session. Goodbye, see you next time.